Hey guys, Popular Boat here, and today I'm playing some more City Skylines. Now, we need a hell of a lot more people. I bet our... Yeah, look at that. We need a thousand more people for the jobs available. So, let's start working out how we're gonna expand to the east. I assume it's the east. I'm calling it the east. East it is. It's all relative anyway. So, this rod, this rod needs to go up here. Um, I want a pretty similar sized area. So let's go to like there. I'm leaving a hell of a lot of space between the free, uh, the highway and where I'm actually building stuff up because I know that I'm going to expand that quite a lot as the game goes on. Uh, let's see, are we getting that stuttering anymore? No, perfect. Okay, so that's going to be the boundary road. Might do this stuff a bit more organised. So, let's have a couple roads in. And that's a bit far back. A couple roads in. I'm not too fussed about the actual spacing. And then we'll subdivide this. So, roads in. Roads across. And then roads across that. Ooh, not quite. Not quite. Let's break this down. And then split that up. I have, um, there's a setting for how you want YouTube to try and optimize and it's set, whoops, it's set to try and be low latency so chat delay isn't so long. But yeah, unfortunately not something I can do anything about. same thing here, and then break this up. I think it also depends what quality level you're watching on too, because YouTube has to process my video from 1080p down to whatever quality level you're watching it at to deliver it to you. And because it's doing that across the world in... Yes, I, <laughs> I am growing the city game. Because YouTube has to do that from across the world... Actually, no. It, um... It's quite a feat. Actually, yeah, okay. Commercial in the center. Residential around the edges. This segment will be a bit more traditional. Traditional city skylines, that is. Let's get to speed two. Run these pipes across. I think the other reason why it seems like time's passing way slower, um, or how the episodes just seem to be flying by, is because of the really slow day-night cycle. 
I might have to tweak that a little bit for the next one. Okay, we need to put more shit into the river. Sorted. Okay, now let's get power across to these dudes. When they actually start building. really don't like how square it all is. It's going to be easier to fit stuff in though. Like this looks quite satisfying. Whereas this is going to look quite square. What a glorious sunrise. I need a bit more industrial. Actually, I should check how far that pollution is reaching. Oh, not quite across. Ah, this is a good time to check traffic. This road is struggling. Let's get the road across there upgraded. It's also because they have to stop. So, how about we upgrade this to a proper crossover? So we've got our crossing, now we get our exits from the highway, bring them up. Connect them in. That one's not quite square, so we'll do that. And we'll even go a little bit further. Now we have a much nicer crossing. Let's get rid of that car park. Those are a bit weirdly steep. Hey, you know, it seems fine. Cool, that's much better. Now power. You need to get elevated a bit as well. Let's bring you to like there. Okay, a bit closer. There we go. That should neaten that up a fair bit. Glorious sunrise, yes, but I couldn't help imagine a video hitting the center of town. Not funny that I looked away from the sunrise saying how glorious it looks. Well, we went from it being like everything in the shadow to being able to actually see how nice it looked, how pretty everything looked in the sunrise. <laughs> All right, um, that should be running a fair bit smoother and we can upgrade the other bits as we need. This stuff is quite busy though. That's something I like to usually do. Because there's going to be a lot of traffic that's only coming in here to do U-turns, let's give them an opportunity to do a U-turn. Do a U-E. Uh, and probably chuck one in here too, actually. So we don't have traffic that's coming off the highway, coming into here and doing a U-turn to go back immediately. We should start seeing people use it. I think that's the only highway connection on the map. 
yeah. So it's going to be quite busy. Why is this... Okay, it is starting to grow now. I was wondering why we had so much demand for residential but no interest in it growing. Oh, maybe they prefer powered connections now. Interesting. <clears throat> okay, we're going to have to get some services over there. guys build in here please and we're just gonna have to make the connection with services here okay, let's get fire medical uh, okay graveyard we'll fix up those borders in a second they're gonna need a school put the school up here, remind the children of their own mortality, we'll chuck in a car park for the school, and let's put some of my little things around the edge here too. So I kept having issues where I had these strange sized parks, so my solution was to make my own little one space car parks that give things nice borders. Like, how nice does that look around the cemetery now? Even though they have no power. Are we just low on power? We are low on power. <clears throat> New power plant time. Let's chuck it opposite the old one. Power's probably the reason water's not flowing. Yeah, there we go. chuck some parks in over here. A nice big ferris wheel and a stadium and then a couple of these little guys. Are you just not going to play nice? Let's get rid of this road. Chuck the park in here where I want it and put the road back. Nope, that's why you weren't going to let me do it, hey. We will make it work. School will result in a philosopher, in many philosophers who will be watching Graveyard Day. I don't know. <laughs> yep. And across from that, there's a nice, lovely Ferris wheel. Ooh. Oh, that's just that road not being connected to anything. Let's get rid of those notifications. Okay, so now... This is quite busy, so I might upgrade this exit to be a two lane. So people can queue to go left and right without getting in each other's way. more residential, which is cons um, convenient with how much we've built. And then we're going to have to start running some buses. Did I forget any services over here? I think we need a high school. We do, but currently there's not enough people. We can use a police station though. That can go there. We've got fire, we've got medical, garbage. We're using three out of four trucks. That's fine. Oh, 
lot more demands for commercial again, which is great. I think we replace some of this with more commercial, to be honest. And a little bit of a footpath. Landscaping. Oh, I forgot that. I forgot that they added um, landscaping tools into the base game. Because I want to use those to flatten out our freeway. Because no one's. not many places would build a freeway that rough. But we'll use that as we get further down to these hillier bits and we cut our way through to go that way. That's definitely my favourite part of town. I like it way more than just this grid. Okay, school should be finishing so we should see a bit of an increase in traffic. Where even is the school? Here. to start finishing work soon. Whoa. This highway is so congested. That's ridiculous. This is pretty pretty congested too. Let's upgrade here. So if the trucks can get down faster. to drop some of these interconnects. Okay. People going all the way across is going to be an issue. That road is going to be very busy. As it already is. Hmm. It'll balance out as we grow though. It is pretty flat. It just doesn't look as satisfying. Like, um, I built on this map before, and you'll see what I mean later. When we have a nice flat thing just cutting through, it looks really nice. Yeah, this is very true. Oh, okay. We need a lot of everything now. Let's grow this area. Get a road through. Hmm. Let's not have a road that goes directly through. And that'll probably fix some of my dislike of that zone. Okay, I want a commercial center. I want it probably about this big. From there we need some residents. And I want to be able to actually fit parts and stuff in without it causing problems. Clear that and cut across, and let's divide this. Yeah, no problem, Excelsior. Thanks for dropping by. Always happy having your company. 
Um, let's do the same again. Let's break this up. And here, we'll chuck in one of those big parks. center. I think we'll keep the middle a little bit square, but not completely. So we have more room for growing stuff out, but it doesn't just look gross and overplanned. Uh, okay, let's bring this out. across. Um, let's come up. Those can connect. We'll run this down. It's oh, a tricky one. Break this guy up. That's nicer. That can come up. You can connect on there. And let's bring you across. This one will bring a road up and then it can curve across. Yeah, that's a much nicer segment. Okay, I think I'll redesign this top one after we finish off here. Okay. Let's start getting people across, and I'll probably have to run some more pipes. Yeah, I do. Chuck him across. Oops, that one's not straight. If I get it wrong now, then I can't just extend these lines later. Okay, let's get these paths across. So our lovely little peeps can walk across. Um, and let's connect some of these. Oh, you're not, you're not going to give me that? Uh, some of these tools. Uh, let's do an anarchy road into there. Connect that across and connect him across. That one can just go straight down. Hopefully that actually connects. I think just to be sure, we'll split it. Okay, yeah, I like that kind of layout a lot more than just a, a subdivided grid. 
Luckily I'm not having a forced OCD habit, otherwise I've gone crazy by now. Well, I think the issue is, it looks really messy when you're just doing roads, but then when it's all fleshed out, it looks really nice. Rubbish collection issues. What a load of rubbish. Okay, four out of four trucks are in use, so we can up our budget to like 75%. Power is good, water is good. We really didn't need the second pumps because I just realized we had our thing turned down. Um, let's pay off the rest of that loan. We really don't need it anymore. Alright. This is looking great. Let's fill it in. Um, let's get our new commercial zoned in as well. far away. We're very close to being a busy town now. 600 pops. We just have to get this filled out and they'll be happily ready to grow. In the southeastern park you've made paths uneven. Oh, this... What I've actually done is left these subdivided evenly. Well, not quite evenly, but as evenly as I can. Because it means that here we'll have a 2x2 two two house, and a 3x2 and a 4x4. Four four. Was that what you were referring to? some of these paths. Ugh. Okay, let's fill in some more. And how about we see if we can fit a park in here. A dog park sounds nice. A jeep. I thought that was a tractor. Someone's just casually parked their tractor out the front of the school. Man, that's looking nice. So, uh, I will show you further. So, if we go back to paths, if I was to just, like, do them evenly, it would break how they line up. So, yeah, there, there was a lot of thinking behind it. It was the best option for breaking up the road. Oh, fire service. Uh, you've kind of got fire service in range, but I guess we can chuck another bot, another guy down. Uh, where can I fit it and the car park next to it? Let's go there. Car park behind the fire station. Actually, that's a bit wide. A little one, and maybe medical center next door. Uh, 
Uh, schools. It's a bit far to try. Oh, okay. Let's do this. We don't need that school there. That's too far away from anywhere useful. So let's move it up here. Uh, there we'll do. So we kind of have one per quad. And let's chuck another school over here somewhere. Next to the high school, I think. Let's move the medical oops, let's move the medical clinic down a square. And we can fit a car park in next to this school. High schools. We have two. I think we'll chuck a third one here in the center. And some park. Ooh. Hmm. I like to make stuff fit nicely. Becomes a bit of an issue. But that will do for there, and that is time for me to call it a break. Break in an episode and bedtime for me. Alright. Thank you guys for watching, I hope you enjoyed the episode, like, subscribe, check out my other videos, and I will see you in the next one.